No red carpet for the stars who usually glam it up for television's biggest night, but we will get a chance to peek into their living rooms in an Emmy Award like no other. Janae Norman is here with what we can expect. Good morning, Janae. Good morning. This year's Emmys will be less glitz and glamour, more couch and slippers. All the nominees this year will be at home, some dressed up, others dressed down, still waiting to see whether they'll win that coveted golden trophy. This morning, we're just one day away from TV's biggest night. It's the Emmys like you've never seen before. Normally, the final hours of the Primetime Emmy Awards are for the finishing touches. Waiters practicing their choreographed champagne serving while others are rolling out the red carpet. But this year, it's a bit different. Hollywood's biggest stars won't be taking center stage from the Staples Center, but rather from home. The Television Academy issuing cameras to each nominee, sending 130 of them to 20 cities and 10 countries. But one thing will be the same. Veteran host Jimmy Kimmel is back. And also think about just trying to, to Zoom with your grandparents and now imagine that we've got 150 celebrities who, are, uh, who haven't made themselves lunch in like 19 years, many of them, are now trying to connect technically to an award show. With COVID-19 keeping many of us indoors, fans have plenty to root for this year. There is a higher likelihood that people who are watching this will have actually seen the shows that they're talking about because we've had a lot of time to sit around and watch television. So who's going to win? We are everyone and we are invisible. All eyes are on fan favorites like Watchmen and Succession. What did you tell us about your mystery call? Oh, the phone call? Uh, yeah, it was Frank. He meant to call you. He wants to know if the plan to overthrow dad is still happening. And of course, no one puts baby in a corner. Tomorrow's primetime show is the final night of the Emmy Award season, with notable winners like Maya Rudolph and Brie Larson already claiming top spots at this year's creative arts ceremony. And the Emmys air tomorrow on ABC starting at 5 p.m. Eastern, 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 Pacific. But the party gets started before that. You can join Eva Witt and I for a countdown to the Emmys, our virtual pre-show, where we'll talk with nominees, take a look at who's likely to win the biggest awards on ABCNews.com, Roku, Hulu, and wherever you can get the ABC News app. All right. So when the party really gets started. <laughs> oh, is when, when we all party. Together. Can I wear a tuxedo <laughs> t-shirt? I've been, like, debating this. Like, I feel oh. like... This is the yes. year for the tuxedos. <laughs> no? Maybe not. Okay. I don't know. Eva said it. I'm with Eva. As a no. <laughs> if I have to wear a dress, you're putting on some, right, at least right. some uncomfortable pants, all right? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.